transcription starts with an enzyme called RNA polymerase, which unwinds and unzips the DNA strands from each other. After the DNA strand is unwinded and unzipped, free-floating nucleotides attaches to one of the strands and makes a copy. Always remember that there are no longer T's attaching to the A's, but instead U's attaching to the A's. When the copy is made, the mRNA releases from the old strand and the DNA closes and rewinds again. The mRNA goes out of the nucleus and attaches to a ribosome in the cytoplasm. The ribosome starts reading the mRNA three bases at a time. The ribosome starts reading at a start codon and ends the reading once an end codon uh, comes along. Now there are free-floating tRNAs coming and attaching once it finds base pairs that matches. As mentioned before, ribosomes keep reading until it comes to a codon that says stop. Also, as the ribosome is reading, only two anticodons can stay on the mRNA at a time. So the last one leaves, but as it leaves, the anticodon leaves behind an amino acid. As the tRNA leaves, the amino acid binds to the next amino acid, eventually creating a polypeptide with peptide bonds binding them together.